and we're just going to take a cup and place it into the center of our dough and we're just going to press down and this is going to give us that perfect little donut hole here in the middle now we're going to take it to the oil i've preheated my oil to 350 degrees and i'm going to slowly lower my donut inside and we're just going to let it slide in be very careful the oil is quite hot my tongs here and we're just going to press down in the center now we're just going to turn that around a little bit and you can see it's nice and golden on the other side so we're going to carefully flip this over look at that our donut is ready now we're going to get of our oil drain off any of the excess Pass it onto our plate here and we're going to let this cool and while this cools we're going to prepare our cream we're going to take our vanilla jello pudding mix and we're just going to pour that into our bowl and to that we're going to add cold milk and we're just going to begin mixing that together until it thickens you can see our instant pudding is already nice and thick i'm just going to take out our whisk place that back here now i'm going to add in my whipped cream and I'm also gonna add in our caramelized bananas. This is gonna give it an amazing flavor. Now we're just gonna carefully turn our bowl and fold in our ingredients. Our bananas are nicely incorporated into our mixture here. This looks great. Now we're gonna come over and we're gonna fill our pastry bag and place it on a cup here. Just scoop some of that in there. Okay, now we're going to start filling our donut. So I'm just going to hold on one side to support it. And we're just going to push our piping tip in the donut. And we're just going to start filling it up. And we're just going to go around the sides. And a little bit of the cream is going to come out at the end. That's completely normal. It just means that we're filling it up properly. Now for the glaze. And we're just gonna pour this over our donut. <gasps> Look how gorgeous that is. And it's going to just spread out. Just give it a little shake here. Take some white chocolate, and we're just gonna come across like this. Give it nice big lines. And can you really have a donut without sprinkles? So we're just going to come and add a few sprinkles around here. We're going to take some vodka. We have our vodka here and we're going to make our flavored vodka today inspired by Cardi B's caramel infused vodka. Now we're going to place our lid back onto our vodka bottle and we're going to give that a good shake. We really want to get that flavor infused in there. Now for our whipped cream. I'm going to come pour a little bit directly into my whipped cream. And now we're going to whip this up to, to get stiff peaks. Now our cream is ready. We're gonna take it over here and place it into our piping bag. Okay, now we're gonna add our whipped cream. I'm just gonna fill it here in the center. For a little decoration, we're gonna add in some car our caramelized bananas. Look how gorgeous these are. And this is really more than just a donut. It's definitely a party donut. And there you have it. Our donut directly on the hot oil. Perfect. I'm going to take out the donut. Perfect. And let it drain and cool on the rack just like that. So now our donut is cold. We can glaze it. So we have here a nice pink icing that we're gonna pour 
on the top of it. Really satisfying. Perfect. And we're gonna keep going with our recipe with our pop. So we're gonna pour our white chocolate that I color with some food coloring. There we go. I have five colors. There we go. And then we're gonna take the entire jar and glaze our pocky. Amazing, this is beautiful. I'm gonna leave the pocky set on the side. So my pocky are back from the fridge. We're gonna transfer them on a board and cut them with a big knife. So make sure that they're really cold. Perfect. I'm gonna move them directly on the plate. Perfect. Make sure that they don't stick together. We're gonna lift them on the side. We print Omer Simpson and put it in a page protector. And we're gonna use it to start our chocolate decor. So I'm gonna start with the black detail. We're gonna create all the details for our head. Perfect. And we're gonna finish with the yellow part. We're gonna just put some pet like that and we're gonna put our Omer Simpson in the fridge. Our Omer is now ready. So we're gonna remove everything from the paper. There we go. And we're gonna do a three dimension donut. So with pink chocolate. There we go. And we're gonna sprinkle the donut, of course, just like that. There we go. 